Today in this tutorial we will create a responsive touch slider or carousel using a JavaScript library called Owl Carousel. So the end result would look something similar to this. So after watching this video tutorial you will be able to create a slider like this using a library called Owl Carousel. So to initiate first what we'll do like we will create this project folder here on our desktop and as you can see there is one folder within this folder called images this folder contains all the images which we want to showcase within our owl carousel slider so you can preview these images so to initiate the development first what, what we'll do like we will create an index.html file here then we will add owl carousel library to our uh, script so what we'll do like first we will create our index.html we will give it a title next we need to download the all carousel from its official website for this we need to add a Make sure you download the latest version. As you can see, I've already downloaded and extracted the file here. So from this folder, what we need, like within the distribution folder of this library, we will copy this JavaScript file and we will add it here. Next from assets folder, we need to copy the cascading style sheet and we need to copy the default styling besides uh, the script we also need to load jquery to our project without jquery we won't be able to run the script so what we'll do like we will download jquery the latest version of jquery from their website you can simply download it from here make sure you download the uncompressed uh, version we will select this whole script create a new file paste there and save it as jquery.js also we need to save this file as index.html so now you can see this is the current structure of our website if you load this you will see nothing but you can see that all the scripts are loaded properly so next what we need to do like we need to load these scripts uh, within our index.html so for that first we will link the style sheet so css once the basic styling is loaded we need to load the other theme default css file Next, we need to load the scripts, uh, text, JavaScript, and within the source. First, we will load jQuery. Next, we need to load the all.carousel.js file. So next we need to head out to the example page of our carousel within demos we will go ahead with this basic version we need to load this script here
copy the HTML structure we will do this within our body you can create a new div and you can assign it a class of main slider close the div next paste your code here I will adjust it a little bit so you can easily differentiate this so next we need to load the images here so what we'll do like for our first item we will simply load the image images one dot jpeg and we need to repeat this for all eight images so yeah that's it let's preview our project folder yeah that's it so now you can see like all the images are placed properly you can see like it's touched enable so you can simply select and drag next you can stylize uh, these images or the slider as per your own requirements as if you want to add border radius to this you can simply assign it to certain styling in this uh, CSS file you can simply add this code here now you can see the styling is assigned so that's it in case if you have any questions do let me know in the comment section uh, besides this slider you can also uh, add any text or any sentences here if you want to create testimonials or reviews you can add anything here and it will scroll properly let's say for example if you want to uh, replace all these images with a certain text we can do that too so what we'll do like to create this we will add some simple text here Text and you can repeat to be title C So yeah, uh, simply you can add anything here like using this class uh, whenever you will assign this class to your parent div uh, this will automatically create an algorithm for any content type. You can add, you can even add videos here, images or any element of your own choice. So that's it. In case if you have any questions, comments or suggestions, do let me know uh, in the comment section and please make sure to subscribe my channel. Thank you. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.